I pulled you guys last week to ask what you thought about um, unboxing videos and the feedback I got was that you like them so here we go um, I just got my the spring box of style from Rachel Zoe um, and just a couple of days ago and so I did technically open the box but I have not pulled everything out yet um, so we will do that together and I'll show you what I got and then also um, in the booklet it's got the value it's got prices it's got it's kind of styling tips things like that so we'll go through it together so the first thing here is the box itself um, these are really nice boxes um, it's kind of I don't know if you can see it's kind of got a little bit of a texture to it um, but it's a pretty blush color and um, with gold last month it was white so I guess I don't know I've only this is only my second box so I don't know if it is different every month but um and then inside hello gorgeous so it's again really nice box but for the price I would think it should be a nice box so okay let's see what we've got first first you pull this out oh, okay this really pretty gold chain bracelet I actually, um, the gold chain bracelet that I have, um, I have broken. So this one is really nice and it's perfect. It's a very classic look. Um, this would be great for wearing on its own, but also stacking with other stuff. Um, let me see the bracelet. This is the Ba You with Love chain bracelet. I guess it's supposed to be like Be You with Love. Um, it is worth $195, <laughs> so was not expecting that. Um, not that it's not nice, but um, I don't own any jewelry that costs that much money besides probably like my wedding ring. Um, so this is, it says these are hand assembled bracelets are made using recycled brass and plated with refined 14 karat yellow gold. So very fond of this, definitely like it and has already surpassed the price I paid for the box by like double. <laughs> so big fan of that. Uh, let's see what's next. Here we have, this is R & Co Waterfall Moisture and Shine Lotion, Lotion Hydration and Brilliance. This is, okay, so this is like a hair mask. Okay, um, apply to wet hair, blow dry or let dry naturally, use on dry hair. Okay, so it really is just like lotion for your hair. Okay. So kind of like a leave-on conditioner. Leave-in conditioner, I mean. Um, vegan, cruelty-free, subtle yet alluring fragrance. Leaves your hair smelling fresh all day. This is worth $29. This is a nice size bottle. This is like a five ounce bottle. Let me see what it smells like. Oh, that does smell good. It is very subtle. Um, it smells just like a really nice salon product. So, bam, also like that. Um, next we have a big bottle. This is a 6.8 ounce bottle of Erno Laszlo Hydrate and Nourish Hydrophil Skin Supplement. So I guess is, I don't know if this is just a skin serum, a moisturizer. Let me check the book. Um, a toner. Okay. So this is a toner use with your favorite moisturizer both day and night revives dry complexions after the harsh winter months i could probably use that um unlike alcohol-based toners this general formula sweeps away dead and aging skin while delivering natural skin renewing nutrients okay great and this is worth 68 dollars so again i've heard of this brand i've not tried it before but i know that this is a highly regarded brand also the r and co i've heard of that too but i don't know that i've tried it but those are two like good brands i hear a lot about um, okay, next. Okay, so this is the one I was really excited about. So in each box, you actually get a choice um, every time. Last month, or last in the winter box, um, there was a choice between a pair of earrings or a necklace, and so I chose the necklace. This time, there was a choice between two different pairs of sunglasses. And these are diff sunglasses. Um, the Diff Bella sunglasses are worth 85 and they had a solid black pair or this tortoise frame, which I went with. And now I'm just going to stare at myself in the camera because I really like these. So, yeah, I went with the tortoise. Ooh, 
these are really comfortable and they fit really well. Um, I have a lot of pairs of just cheap sunglasses. I usually just pick up like a $10 pair of sunglasses, um, which is fine. And I love them and wear them and lose them and scratch them up or whatever. But you can tell a big difference in how these fit and how they feel. These feel really good on. They feel secure. They're not tight, very comfortable. Um, and they'll go with everything. So, um, you will probably be seeing me wear these a lot. Um, this says, and I also don't know much about the Diff brand. Another brand I've heard of, haven't tried myself. This says, um, for every pair sold, Diff provides a sight, of, the gift of sight to someone in need. So I don't know if that means they provide eyeglasses, that they provide eye health in some fashion, but I will look into that. Um, every frame is hand cut, making them more comfortable and flexible for everyday wear. I definitely agree, those are super comfortable. So that's probably the most comfortable pair of sunglasses that I have or have tried. Okay, then the last item in the box was this really pretty bag. So this is a mix of um, like a vegan leather and suede. Very nice, just a nice shoulder bag. It's got, let's see, it's got a nice magnetic clasp there. It does have a zipper pocket inside, so that's nice. Um, this is a great size bag for me. I like a nice slouchy bag. This will go with everything, but also I'm kind of moving out of not having to carry a diaper bag with me constantly anymore, but I still do need a bag big enough to throw in snacks and a change of clothes and um, maybe these EpiPens, stuff like that. So, um, really like this bag. And this, let me see. I'll tell you what it is and how much it is worth. Um, this is the Shirelia Arden Tote. It's worth $74. Uh, classic hobo silhouette gets a fresh update by way of a subtle mixed media crafted from vegan leather and suede. So this definitely, it talks about how this is a good transitional tote and I agree it really does, this will work well against like your dark winter shades. It'd be really pretty with like cranberries and um, dark greens and navy but then also it's gonna look really good with like spring florals and pastels. And um, so, I mean, it's a really good piece. So I think for $74, that's a nice bag. That's something that I would have probably paid for that on its own. And that's about what I paid for the box. So again, the box itself costs, um, I think the price is right at about $100, but um, for your first box, if you use my code, you can get, I think $25 off your first box. And then you also have the ability, if you share your code with their people, you can get credits and they sign up using your link. You can get credits to put towards future boxes. So this box for me, I had credits on from um, someone signing up from last time. So I don't make tons of like money off this box itself. Like I paid for this box myself, but I do have an affiliate link. So if you do sign up under me, I will either get some money back on that, depending on that link, um, if you use that one or I'll get credit towards another box. So just want to let you know that, that I will get something back by doing this review if people sign up. But, um, but this is one I totally done on my own just because I was curious about it. So wanted to share my honest thoughts with you because I know that this is definitely a much more expensive box. Other ones I've tried in the past have been closer to like a $50 range. But, um, I think for the value of what you get in these boxes is really, really good. So I know I haven't added up the total value of this, but I'll put that in the final post. But um, last time in the winter box, I think the value is over $500 of what the products are worth. Plus, as a new member, you will get a free gift. And I don't know what that gift is right now. When I signed up, it was a really pretty, a nice tote bag. And so the total value of the box was like $650 or something. <laughs> so, and when I signed up, I had a coupon code. So I paid, I think, yeah, $75 and got $650 worth of stuff, which I think is a really good deal. So, um, so that's the spring box and I will also have the post up. You can see pictures and things like that too. But then, um, but let me know if you try it or if you have questions about it or if there's another box I should try. Um, I know subscription boxes seem to be everywhere these days. It's hard to know kind of what's worth it, but I do think this box, the Rachel Zoe box of style, is a really good value. It's high quality products. Um, so far these have been all like full size products too. So um, I'm a fan. So let me know what you think and if you are gonna try it yourself and I will see you soon.